Hello, boys and girls. My name is Otsisi, and welcome back to Season 28, Episode 2 of my FTL series. We are back in the um, on this cruiser layout B, where we got two weapons, two missile weapons. Well, it's better than nothing. Um, and we also have a third uh, Montes to our crew, so um, we should be good here. Uh, three Montes boarding party, that's a good thing. And we should be able to deal with uh, them quite easily, as you just saw. So let's heal everybody up. And then we got the sector revealed to us. Asteroid here, distress. Okay. Let's use the uh, boarding drone here, which is probably an overkill because the uh, the asteroids will do enough damage to them, so they are already gone. Now we only have to wait for our FTL to come online so we can move on. Then we move to this distress. and lead them to their destination which is up here right close to the exit so we might be able to make it then we can go over here into the nebula where we find another automated ship Boarding drone again, and this might take a while, so I will see you once this is done. Alright, they are on their last hull point and uh, should be finished quite soon. There they go. We get a bit of uh, rewards for that, so maybe we can have second weapon points there, a uh, bit more engine, and then still have a bit of uh, scrap left, because there is a store down there, to which I think we want to go. We will attack this ship again with the boarding drone, which means it will take once again a bit of time and I will see you once it's done. These kind of automated ship with uh, the compartments all connected together are so much better when dealing with a boarding ship or boarding drone because the compartment where the boarding drone enters there will be a breach so that system will never be repaired and with the other layout of the automated ship um, you then only have one other system which then tends for a bit of a lengthy fight like this one and this in addition 
has a missile. So we have to deal with that as well. With the uh, defense drone. And this can take quite a while. So you know the drill. Soon this ship will go the same way all the previous automated ship have gone before it. That way. And we got a bit of scrap out of it. Very nice. Um, then we go to the store. We sell the missile. Don't care for that. Don't need repair, but let's buy a bit of uh, fuel and um, nothing else. Distress and then up towards that quest. Give them the two fuel. And then we move on. And another automated chip. This is a really rich. This really has a lot of automated ships, but hopefully we can deal with this one as well, same way we did with any ship we dealt with before. So. I will see you once we have made some progress. We did not even get around to destroy all their systems once, but um, we managed to train our pilot fully with all these uh, ships, which is something, and it's another double reward, which is also nice. They have a missile, we have a defense drone and a boarding crew. And they're gone. For once, this was a quick fight, not like the lengthy ones against the uh, automated ships. Well, probably those were quick for you as well. Um, let's see. Let's buy the next shield. And go to the quest. Reactor upgrade. And to the exit. Okay, more scrap. And then we will move on to uh, Uncharted Nebula because Sultan controlled with sporting and no weapon to um, deal with their salt and shields. That's just not good. But that's for next episode. Until then, goodbye!